When faced with a difficult task or an ambitious vision, it's not uncommon to encounter roadblocks that put your patience and perseverance to the test. It's often much easier to give up than to keep pushing yourself towards something you want, but that doesn't seem to want you back. However, if you have already decided to achieve a goal regardless of the obstacles, the only key to unlocking that door to success is perseverance. Being persistent means choosing to persevere in the face of adversity and failure. It is your ability to get back up after falling down. In this video, we are going to present you with 10 ways to become persistent that will help keep you on track toward your goals. Number 1. Dream big, start small. It is critical to have a vision and plan your path to achieving it. It will give you a sense of direction, but don't get too caught up in attempting to tackle your goals right away. You must have big dreams, but keep in mind that you won't get there unless you start with the least amount of work possible. Aside from keeping you from becoming overwhelmed, doing small tasks can help you get through the day. The day, not the week or the year. When you keep working without seeing the light at the end of the tunnel, it's easy to become burned out. But the key is to start with a small flame and take it one step at a time. Number 2. Know the reason behind your goals. Having a source of motivation is the key to doing more. And this motivation is found in the reasons for doing something in the first place. Remember that actions have consequences. Persistence entails returning to the whys and allowing them to fuel your motivation to keep going. What is your why in your goal? This is a common question, but it forces you to consider what you truly want out of your goal. How do you discover your why? Ask as many questions as you can think of. Why do I do this? Why do I value this over that? Why am I stressed now? If you keep asking these questions, you'll almost certainly get the same answer. That is almost always the answer to your why in life. That is the motivation that propels you forward in life. Number 3. Build your discipline. To become a persistent person, you must work on developing discipline. And there is no better way to cultivate persistence than to cultivate self-discipline. That's why, when you work consciously to improve your self-discipline, you strengthen your willpower. And by strengthening your willpower, you are essentially increasing your ability to persuade yourself to do something you may not want to do but you that know you must do. As a result, when you develop and strengthen your self-discipline, you also develop your ability to persevere. So, work on developing your self-discipline while also improving your ability to persevere. Number 4. Keep a positive mental attitude. The road to success is not easy. In fact, it is difficult, which is why only a few people succeed. There will be numerous occasions when you will be confronted with defeat and failure. And if you are weak, you will succumb to negative thoughts of fears and doubts. Maintaining a positive mental attitude in any situation is essential for developing persistence and eventually succeeding in your endeavor. Maintain your focus on taking action toward your goals. Negative thoughts and feelings will disrupt your concentration and persistence. Number 5. Disassociate from negative influences. It will benefit you to distance yourself from bad influences if you genuinely wish to develop the trait of persistence. Negative influences might come from anyone who minimizes your potential or makes you doubt what is feasible for you. Such influences may include family members, friends, colleagues, groups, or media outlets. People that are poisonous and negative will also make an effort to divert you from completing the steps you have promised to take to accomplish your goals. Time spent with them needs to be limited, even if they are unintentionally distracting you. Number 6. Rest. Don't quit. You must believe in taking deliberate breaks. It is critical that you give yourself time to rest in between attempts to conquer the world. As an expression says, you can't give what you don't have. So, how can you keep going when you are already exhausted on the inside? One of the most important lessons you must learn about persistence is that taking a break does not imply giving up. It does not imply that you are wasting time or being sluggish. 
Rest is an essential part of the process rather than a hindrance to it. So, if you're having difficulty pursuing your goal or completing a task, it could be your inner self telling you that it's time to recharge before making another move. Number 7. Find different solutions to your setbacks. When it comes to sticking to your goals, you can sometimes be too stubborn or rigid. However, it may be more beneficial to maintain an open mind and find a different route to your destination. You must determine when something is no longer functional. It doesn't mean you made the wrong decision. It simply means there must be another option. In this stage of the process, you must be inventive. Maybe you don't have the right tools, so you have to make them yourself. Perhaps you don't have to follow the traditional path, and you can forge your own. Number 8. Don't be afraid to start again. Starting over does not imply that you have failed. While it may take you longer to get where you want to go, it is also an opportunity to identify your mistakes and hopefully go through the process much more smoothly the second time. Also, remember that we all have our own moment to shine. Maybe 2022 wasn't the year for you, but what if it's the following? You don't have to give up right away. Maybe you just have to wait it out and start over with a better equipped version of yourself. Number 9. Build your accountability group. The accountability group is composed of people who can assist you in reaching your goal. Having an accountability group is a great way to stay on track. When people are watching what you're doing and ensuring that you're going to do what you said you'd do, deviating from or breaking your promises becomes extremely difficult. Choose wisely whom you will include in your accountability group. Include only those who can give you unbiased judgments and who have a positive mental attitude, if at all possible. You can't afford to waste time listening to cynical advice and pessimistic people. These people will not help you succeed. Instead, they will drain your energy, which will eventually lead to failure. Number 10. Study persistent people. This final piece of advice can help you persevere even when you feel like giving up. Study those who are persistent to stay motivated. It is in your best interest to research and watch other persistent individuals if you wish to become one yourself. Learning about how others persevered in the face of insurmountable obstacles can motivate you to keep going. Studying persistent people who achieve their goals can also help you understand your circumstance and determine whether or not you've been persistent enough. One of the main causes of failure for most people is a lack of persistence. Fortunately, it can be fixed with work and dedication. And the more determined you are to get over your lack of perseverance, the faster you'll turn into the determined, persistent person that you picture yourself as being. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to stay tuned to such helpful content. Thanks for watching.